good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of the Lies of P. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we're going to continue our adventure through the city of Krat. But before we do, like always, let's go ahead and talk about everything I did off screen. And I did absolutely nothing. So there's nothing to talk about. With all that being said, let's go ahead and get started. So first things first, let's talk to Sophia. I'll use my power to help. I am able to wield Ergo. They call me a listener. Because I can hear Ergo. I inherited the power from my mother, who hated it. Called it the Devil's Power. So I kept it a secret that I could talk to puppets. Now you are the only one my voice reaches. So I beg you, please, save Krat. See if Paladina has anything to say. Welcome to Hotel Crop. Nope. What about the old lady? Ooh, you know what? Let's play the piano. wonder if we keep playing the piano if we'll get better. He doesn't seem half bad. People have no idea so many thanks for keeping. Nope. Where's that kitty cat? Oh, Figaro. Where are you? Is it over here? It's always wandering around. I did find it um, off screen. I think it was upstairs somewhere. I don't know where the cat went. I think it's sneaky. Okay, let's talk to Geppetto, and then I'm going to show everybody about the P organ. Remember, I didn't design every puppet in Krat. It is not surprising that some puppets broke away from the Grand Covenant. I've no idea how many. I remember a few ergo puppets behaving according to their own volition before the frenzy. That wasn't our intention. They were never designed to act that way. But if a puppet starts acting on its own, does that mean the puppet has free will? Or is someone else controlling the puppet? Good question, Geppetto. The city of Krat. It's probably not how you remember it, eh? Ask me any question. Okay, we know about all that. So when you go to the P organ to level it up and do all that, what I learned is when you come in here, so you can come in, let's say, for instance, here, and you go to an empty slot and you put let's say an attack type on your empty slot here. What you do for your second slot is go over to a different type. So we're on attack type. We want to go over to like survival type with R1 or your ability type or the item type, whichever type you're kind of feeling. And I went with getting the, oh, did not mean to get all the way out of that. 
Um, I went with Link Dodge and then having an extra pull cell. I felt like that was a little better than the increased staggerable window and the added fable slot. Not sure where I'll go next. I'm definitely probably going to increase my pulse cells and probably do dodge again. I, I, I like being able to dodge. Okay, let's continue on. feel like interacting with that cat is important. Just like when we um, played with the piano and it was like, oh, humanity. And then when I listened to the music and it was talking about something changed inside me, I feel like the cat is important as well. I don't know for sure, obviously, but, you know, you never know. I might have to find it off screen. I feel like this is going to open up or something eventually. It just seems like it. Let's go over here. This is the last place I'm going to check and then we're going back to... Oh, that's for Rosa Isabella Street. It's probably one of the last places... We need to go. Okay, I tried. Let's go ahead and go to the Stargazer. Oh, we can switch these. I'm going to stick with fire right now. I don't have anything electrical on me anyways. And then we're going to go to Moonlight Town. take this stuff off anything behind here no. feeling we're gonna have yep somebody throwing shit at us over there ow dude those guys got some arms man they need to be playing football or baseball I'm going to come up here and mess you up, dude. Oh, and I guess to put the um, grindstone on for the fire, you have to hold L1 and then square. Or else it's just going to sharpen your... Um, or repair your weapon, not sharpen it. I'm sorry. Which is good. That means that we can still repair our weapon and put an element on there. But it said we can only do it one time until we rest at a stargazer or die. I feel like that's going to break. gonna try to jump across because I really don't want to fall down yeah exactly exactly <laughs> uh 
I have played too many Souls games in my life to know better. Can we jump up there? Oh, we can? Oh, that's cool. We can't jump up there, though. Just star fragment after star fragment. We're getting a lot of thermite, so I have a feeling we're going to be doing something with thermite or fire. Oh, hey, there is a thing over there that we missed. I do not like to miss goodies. No siree. Oh, looks like we could have hopped down here and then went over here and got up. Okay. That's cool. Well, instead of uh, running across. Okay, so there is a red butterfly somewhere around here. It's just a matter of where. There it is. Crescent moon. We needed that. Oh, shit. There's another one. Probably leading me into a trap for sure. Another crescent moon. Moonlight town guide. Give everybody a minute to pause and read over this stuff. I know I uh, read all of it. It's actually really interesting lore. Any more red butterflies over here? I'm holding on to that ergo until I get a ton of it. Or ergo. I keep calling it ergo. It's ergo. That's how they pronounce it. Wow, really? Can't go through there? Well, we see that there's an ambush. That there's an ambush over here, too. So what we're going to do is this. Of course. Of course you're throwing things. Come on. Come over here, bud. Oh, wow. Well, that sucks. Oh, my God. Please don't die, Mr. Wayne. Holy fuck moly. So many of them in here. Hmm. Let's see what that does.
not for that. It is for maybe this. Oh, it's more for the corrosion reduction. We'll see. We'll see um, which ones we end up using. Well, that encounter was terrifying. I doubt there's illusory walls in this game. You friendly? Do you want to go up, child? I'm sorry, but the train isn't in service anymore. The cathedral isn't the sanctuary it once was. The people who went up there never returned. I still don't know what happened, but I do know this. The cathedral is off limits forever. If you're determined to pass, you must prove your identity. Who are you? Are you... A stalker. Interesting. I thought all the stalkers died when the workshop tower collapsed. As for me, I'm as good as dead. A sinner who lost everyone I ever loved. I have no right to stop someone as determined as you. Please be safe up there. Please be safe up there. Um, I wonder if that was a good thing or not that we just lied to her. of you who joined us in Moonlight Town, we hope your preparations for the Pilgrim's Journey are well underway. Fascinating town, Moonlight. Just fascinating. Back in the day, the only way to reach the cathedral was using a rope and pulley. <laughs> so, thanks for building it on a cliff, St. Frangelico. I kid, I kid. Frangelica, wonderful saint, wonderful. Anyway, next stop, the Bridge of Atonement. While you atone there, don't miss a magnificent view of beautiful Crot. <laughs> it's been my pleasure, friends, and enjoy the rest of your journey. I've been your captain on this ride, Gemini! <laughs> well, not bad, huh? Oh, I really am good at this. When in doubt, let Gemini be your guide. <laughs> You, uh, you look annoyed. what I do? Ah, I'm sure it's fine. Let's get a move on, pal. I am starting to really like Jiminy. Oh, something's off. Do you see that over there? I recognize dead puppets. That's to be expected. But what is that? What is what? But, I mean, those are just like normal dead bodies. I, I don't know. I don't know what he's talking about. Those things are, pal. Approach with caution. Yeah, that looks like a Zambi. Oh my god, you are fast, dude. 
Holy shit, they're fast. You're not dead, are you? There's another one walking around over there. Hidden Moonstone. That is a lot. That is a lot. Let's go up to the top here. I have a feeling that's why we got thermite a bunch of it earlier. Is these guys are going to be vulnerable to fire. Come on. Run over to me. Like there's something in there, but I don't know. Ah, I knew it was going to break. It's too far for me to jump, so no matter what, I was falling down. So far, these guys are pretty easy, but that doesn't mean anything. I'm sure, if you get a big group of them, they're not so easy. What's their problem? Wait, wait, their bodies are strangely altered. I don't know what's going on, but keep those eyes of yours open. <laughs> Smart of the developers hiding enemies behind the boxes. Nice. Good thing I'm trying to look everywhere for items. It's a really cool looking statue. Woman's Prayer. Yeah, we're getting more stuff with fire, so I'm going to assume that they are weak to fire. That looks like the way I should be going. Let's go over this way. That is a boss. So let's go this way first, and then we'll come back over that way. OK, 
Okay, there's somebody over here. Please don't attack me. Ah, mercy, I beg you, don't kill me. <sighs> I thought you were from the organization. Uh, never mind. My name is Janjo. I'm an alch... Uh, a pharmacist. Yes, pharmacist. I'm looking for the legendary gold coin fruit. I was able to use medicine to slow the infection spread. I have the petrification disease and I need a cure. Sorry, I ramble when I'm nervous. Read this. It'll explain things faster than I can. Okay, so he is definitely lying to us because he almost said he's an alchemist and that's one of the two different uh, groups. So I might keep an eye on this guy. Many substances can be poisonous. The precise dose is what separates medicine from poison. The gold coin fruit might just be a myth. But in the midst of an epidemic, it might be our salvation. C can you let me know if you find it? I'll give you this by way of payment. Hmm. The people of ancient Krat knew how to bottle a wish upon a star. They claimed special powers after distilling the wish into a cube made from a meteorite. I don't know how it works, but it's said to react to someone who has ergo and grant them power. If you can help me with the gold coin tree, I'll give you more of this. Okay, that's interesting. I'll have to do a little more reading on that to figure it out. I'm headed to the St. Frangelico Cathedral. You can find me there if you need me. Let's go ahead and go over here. Hopefully we don't have a boss, because the stargazer is kind of far away. Ray? Can I? Do I have a... Oh yes, gesture. No, I don't have prey as a gesture. All right, let's give it a shot. My good God, there's a lot of things killing each other. Ouch. Shit, dude. Oh my god. No. All right. Now that I made it all the way back over here, let's go ahead and try this again. Oh, 
Oh, it's only the one guy now, huh? Alright, alright. I got gotcha, you, homie. Let's do the damn thing. It's a little cheap, but I don't care. And whoa, that actually looks really cool. Really, really pretty. Right there's City Hall. That's where we fought the um, policeman. And then over there is Vanini's works. And then I don't know what's way over in the distance there. Maybe we'll end up going over there. I don't know where Hotel Krat is. Maybe that round building off in the distance. Oh, we actually have a stargazer. And a bunch of greenish teal blood. Let's talk to this guy. We talked to him earlier. Gold coin trees are said to blossom when plague stalks the land. P perhaps they've already bloomed somewhere in Krat. The people of ancient Krat knew how to bottle a wish upon a star. They claimed special powers after distilling the wish into a cube made from a meteorite. It's said to react to someone who has ergo and grant them special power. Temporarily. Maybe you'll find a star to wish on, Stalker. <laughs> and if you do, I hope this cube helps you with that. Um, yeah, this guy is probably not up to no good, but he's definitely lying to us about some stuff. I want to see if maybe remembrance will work. Nope. I don't think we're going to continue any further here. Oh, wow. The hell is that thing? Looks like a boss. So, yeah, we're definitely not going to continue any further. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to end the video, I think, right about here. And when we come back, we will continue further into this cathedral so i want to start by telling everybody thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video it really does mean a lot to me hopefully you all enjoyed the video if you did go ahead and hit that thumbs up button if you didn't hit the thumbs down button let me know why down in the comments below it only helps the channel also if you enjoy content just like this be sure to subscribe or don't i don't know i'm not your dad do whatever you want and like always everybody have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night, whatever time it may be in your part of the world. Mr. John Wayne, signing off.